Hi families, Miss Tiff here from Armed Services YMCA San Diego to show you how to make a handprint flower Mother's Day card. Let's get started. Okay, the first step that you're going to need to do is to gather some supplies. So I chose two different colored pieces of construction paper. I went with pink and yellow. You're going to need a couple pieces of green also, so put those to the side. <laughs> then you're going to need a pencil, a marker, any color that you choose. I'm just going with basic black. A pair of scissors, maybe use some safety scissors if you're, if you're a little guy. And some glitter just to embellish it. First step is you're going to trace your hand. Using your marker, go ahead and go around the edge of your entire hand. Yay, we did it! The next step is you're going to get your scissors and you're going to cut your entire outline out, okay? So just that line that you just created, that shape of your hand, you're going to cut the whole thing out just like that okay I'm gonna go all the way around cutting the whole thing it is you should be left with something like this much smaller because miss tiff has big hands <laughs> okay and what you're gonna do next is you're just gonna place that there on the, on the construction paper and you're gonna get your extra green paper i use this side the long side and i cut just a little strip and that's gonna be your stem so you're going to have mommy and daddy help you, or you can do it yourself. I think you're big enough to do this on your own. And that strip that you get is going to be your stem. So when you hold it up, you might notice, like, oh, this is a little, no, perfect. Okay, that'll work. That'll work. Good. Put that off to the side. You're going to get some more green paper. And I have two little squares like this, rectangles. I have two rectangles like this, and I'm just going to... Cut them into the shape of a leaf. I'm just gonna go around like that on the one side. I'm gonna flip it over and I'm gonna go around like that all the way up to that point. And you can see I have a couple of leaves. Now leaves, they have sometimes have little like shapes on the edge of them, and I'm just gonna repeat that by making little cuts along the edge. And to make it look even more real, I'm gonna make a little bend down the center like that and there you go a little leaf if you want leaves have a central vein down the center you can use your pencil to draw that or your marker there you go so let's assemble our picture for our mommy we're making a flower so we know that we're gonna have to glue all of this down let's go ahead and glue the stem to the back of the flower first. So we're just gonna flip it over, put a little bit of glue on this top piece of the stem. Then you're going to flip it over. Perfect. And you're going to put a little more glue straight down the whole stem so that we can get it glued down. Perfect. Yes, this is looking good. And then we're just going to use a little bit of glue just to keep these little edges down. A little bit there. But if you want your, your hand print flower to kind of move, it's okay to leave these up and moving like that. I kind of think that looks cool. So you can leave it like that if you like. Maybe get a little more glue here so that part stays down. There. Perfect. Good job. That's already looking awesome. Okay, let's put our leaves. We're gonna just glue them down just the way we did the stem and flower. A little bit of glue on the back. We're all done. Just joking. No, we have to sign our work and we have to, this is for Mother's Day, so we have to write Happy Mother's Day on it. So I am going to write, I'm gonna get my marker and I'm gonna write. Happy Mother's Day right here. H A P P Y Mothers M O T H E R and a little apostrophe because it's her day, Mothers, and then Day. 
D A Y. I'm going to put an exclamation point with a little heart. Yay! And I want to sign my name over here so Mama knows what, who made this for her. And she also knows what year it was. 2020. And now I want to make it extra, extra special. So I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of glitter. So maybe you want to just draw some squiggly lines on your flower. And then you're going to open your glitter to the open and you're going to shake a little bit out until you cover your glue. Mommy and Daddy definitely have to help you with this because you can go kind of wild with glitter and it gets everywhere. But that's okay. Okay. Well, this is the trick right here. You got to fold your off just like that and then find another piece of paper. I'm gonna dump off the excess, shake it out, and then I'm left with just my design. Isn't that pretty? And there you have it. You made your mama something really beautiful for Mother's Day. I hope you enjoyed that craft and you get it done at home. Bye, littles. Happy Mother's Day, mamas.